hey guys um so until i i have a cooler intro we're just gonna have to deal with the the awkwardness that i have in the beginning of the videos <laughs> in the beginning of the videos but in any case okay that's that's gone past um today i wanted to keep the video short and simple um i generally want to do one video a week but also we're not boxing ourselves in so if i want to spice things up by throwing a random video then hey um so today i really just wanted to quickly chat about or rather to chat to um people that feel like they're frustrated with you know not being where they want to be and things like that here's the thing and while I appreciate that today's video might appeal to more women, women are held under so much more scrutiny than men. And hence, we end up holding ourselves under so much scrutiny because that's just how the world has, you know, taught us to be. To just scrutinize and nitpick every single thing about ourselves. But anyway, um, I really think we should stop being so upset at what our bodies can't do and really start to celebrate what our bodies can do um we are in a body that does so much behind the scenes like your body is not only protecting you from like disease like your immune system is fighting off diseases daily you know your hormones are balancing and trying to keep you in check your mental health is kept in check your gut health your body's digesting every single day your body's able to move and take you from this place to that place you know and you want to be mad at, at your body for not giving you a six pack or you want to be mad at your body for not shrinking fast enough to get to your goal weight and let's talk about your goal weight how do you know that that is your goal weight other than you wanting to shrink to that weight because you feel like that's the best weight that's where you look your best yes you might have looked that way when you were 16 but there's no real backing or there's no real evidence or justification for why you want to reach a certain number other than you feeling like that's the number that is best well here's the thing it's not and maybe you really need to start looking into the targets that you're setting for yourself and whether or not that is actually the best place to be because the moment you start looking at the reason behind the reason is where you'll see okay maybe that's not actually the best place for me um maybe i'll never weigh what i used to weigh when i was a teenager maybe the goal weight that i set for myself is actually not where i'm supposed to be it's killing myself i shouldn't be that way and that's where the real freedom comes in when you realize that you don't have to get caught up in arbitrary numbers and you don't have to try and get to a certain weight in order for you to feel like you can celebrate who you are and what you achieve set goals that aren't related to anything superficial set goals like i'm going to be faster i'm going to be stronger i'm going to be more balanced i'm going to be more flexible i'm going to do 10 push-ups or 20 or 50. set something that you can benchmark and you can say hmm i did more than i did yesterday and that is what will keep you coming back don't set a target based on a number on a scale because you know that's that's something that can that can fluctuate i don't want this video to get too long all i wanted to say is don't get hung up on the numbers set better targets um in the interim celebrate yourself celebrate your body celebrate what you can do celebrate the fact that you were able to do something that you weren't able to do the day before and that's what it's about and that is essentially going to be the essence of this channel let go of random numbers that only you know where those came from. That's all I'm saying.